I'm uh, speaking with Charlie Cracknell, who's the event director of IFSEC International. Uh, hi, Charlie. Hi. Um, just wanted to ask you about the convergence report that uh, we released recently, mm -hmm. uh, along with Frost and Sullivan. Um, that was quite interesting reading. I'm wondering just how that feeds into what's going to happen for IFSEC 2012. The research really gave us a good understanding of what the future holds for the security industry. Uh, I suppose the key thing with IFSEC is, IFSEC is representative of the entire buying chain. So from manufacturer through to distributor, uh, integrator, installer, uh, to then our consultants and end users, they all have uh, a stake in the market and as such, convergence um, is something that's high on the agenda. You know, IP is clearly driving that. Um, the crossover between logical and physical security uh, is happening. Uh, that's proven. Um, it's in an embryonic stage, uh, but what we were able to do with Frost and Sullivan is identify where the market was going, where the key synergies were. Uh, if looking at IFSEC as a whole, uh, CCTV and access control kind of lead the way, purely because of the nature of the types of products and the, and the network they, they're on. Uh, and it's really looking at how those systems are then used, not just for security, but for other business intelligence needs. For us, it helps shape what IFSEC is going to be in the future. Uh, and on that basis, we're able to educate, uh, inform uh, across the board um, where the market's going, what it's doing, and essentially where the benefits uh, in using IP and IT together uh, can truly work. We've got the Integrated Intelligence Zone, which is sponsored by ISM. Uh, that's really looking at uh, a mixture of IP uh, and analog system, so it's really looking at the hybrid solution. Uh, so for that, end users and installers will be able to go and visit that particular feature in Hall 4. That will enable them to see how solutions can work together. Mm. So you can have uh, what is legacy system working with a new breed of IP solutions, but you can wrap the two together, which really makes your, your business get best uh, kind of bang for its buck, uh, and equally it helps you manage how you will future-proof in your business. Okay. Uh, on top of that, then looking at the IP, um, I suppose, topic in, and putting it into context, uh, TABCOM training uh, were present at IFSEC last year and will be again present this year. They'll be really focusing on how to implement IT, IP solutions uh, across uh, CCTV, access control and intruder, uh, seeing again how they work in harmony together, but also giving, uh, let's say, installers and end users an understanding of how the technology is our best place to work. Um, what cameras to use, um, what resolutions they should be looking at setting up and really understanding what they're asking for. Um, and this is probably where the next part of uh, the show comes on is we're working and uh, we're excited to work with Annex to this year who have decided to exhibit at the event which is exciting for us and really pulls into the context that the IT and commercial security market is very much overlapping. Mm -hmm. Now, Annexta are going to be running an IP assured uh, seminar theatre where they'll be addressing concerns of both the end user and installer integrator through the channel and giving them the information they need so that they can take that back into the market with the knowledge that they're speaking in the right language, in the right context, to make sure the security managers can understand what they're asking for but at the same time that they can speak to their IT teams and give them the information they need rather than the information they think they need. And what about the uh, innovation showcase? Is that a, that's a new feature as well, isn't it? Yeah, the one thing that we do is we spend an awful lot of time researching our visitors, mm -hmm. not just our visitors, but our exhibitors. And that takes place at the event and post-event. And the feedback that we got and the outstanding feedback we got was that people come to see new products. Mm -hmm. Not just new products, but new technologies and new solutions. And the size of IFSEC, they found it difficult to identify on exhibitor stands what was new versus what was maybe an upgrade. Mm -hmm. Now, whilst the two sit very closely in harmony, they were really keen on seeing what was new. So as part of that, the Innovation Showcase will identify key new products within the event which will then be hosted in a particular part of the show floor and from that we'll then push the message back so that people can go and visit the individual exhibitor stands. But this will be specifically for brand new products to market. Um, we have to listen to what the visitors want and so we have to deliver what they want to see.
Brilliant. Thanks very much, Charlie. Pleasure.